Well, it's Thursday and tonight 6 News is here for your health. As the temperatures drop and home heating systems run to keep us warm, the risk of carbon monoxide poisoning increases. Carbon monoxide can quickly make people disoriented. Stephanie Stahl has one Delaware student story of how technology saved her life. Natalie Nasaka is starting the new year grateful to be alive. I ended up losing consciousness. She's describing a bout of carbon monoxide poisoning that happened in her Smyrna, Delaware apartment. I was feeling extremely exhausted and my vision was getting blurry. Before she passed out, she reached for her watch. This button you She hit SOS, putting out the emergency call to 911. But when um, I heard the the firefighters yell out fire department and they yanked me out of bed. I just started crying and saying, I want to live, I want to live. Carbon monoxide is a gas that has no color, odor, or taste. It's called a silent killer, claiming more than 400 people a year and sending 50,000 Americans to the emergency room. Because it is a lack of oxygen, really, that affects the body, uh, there are certain things that do become irreversible. The early warning signs include dizziness, confusion, and vomiting. Now I've been riding waves of emotions. Natalie, who's a student, says she was lucky that help arrived quickly and she was revived in the ambulance with oxygen. Well, the carbon monoxide was confirmed because the fire department's monitor read 80 parts per million in the apartment, which is extremely high. She thinks the gas leak came from a faulty heater, which is one of the leading causes for carbon monoxide poisoning in the winter. And there was no detector in the apartment, something Natalie admits she should have had for herself and her pet, who survived because firefighters opened a window. It was extremely scary. Stephanie Stahl, CBS News, Philadelphia.